Hello everyone and welcome back to episode 2 of the Disguise 2 PC uh, LP. So I have fixed the, uh, the D-pad, so now I can use the D-pad to go through these menus, which is going to be great. Um, and uh, I have not fixed, I have not figured out how to fix um, the buttons. But that is rather not mattery, just due to the fact that uh, I kind of get it anyway. Um, um, it's weird because square doesn't do anything. I almost feel like it should be X, or it should be jump, but that's beside the point. So, uh, level 3 with a bow, got brawny muscle from healing a bunch, bot buckler so the defense wouldn't be absolute shite, uh, pog love with no other stuff, and this stuff. So 7, 5, 3, should be fine. Um, Okay. Yeah, right. They can't fire me. I'll confirm it one more time. That wasn't my fault. It must be the crew's mistake. Uh-huh. Mr. Axel the Dark Hero should blame everything on someone else. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Get it? This is all a part of the act. This must be a prank show to test my reaction to being fired, right? Only Mr. X has the eyesight to see through the layers of this prank. <laughs> they should have told me earlier. They love to joke around. Is the camera hidden behind that bush? <laughs> Hell, I'll just pretend like I still haven't figured it out. Right there! I'm the one who's going to help these guys and win the grand prize! Woo! Okay. So Axel being full of himself. How how quaint. Okay, defense plus 50, enemy boost plus 100. Um, ooh, level 6s. Okay, I should be able to do this, in all honesty. Um, I feel like what they're going for here is to... Uh, throw this, destroy it, and then, uh, and then you'll get the, uh, thing, the, uh, whatchamacallit, um, the, the geo, uh, advance, so you can throw three, okay, where can you throw specifically two? Okay. Yeah. And if I go pink there, I believe it's in this game they added the uh, bounce mechanic. Yes. Glad I remembered right. And I can come up here with him. Shocking soul. Okay. Okay. trying to figure out. Yeah, it doesn't seem like I can speed it up, actually. Oh, damn. This might actually kill my thief. <laughs> oh, well. What else is now? Yep. Okay, bonus gauges. Relatively high. And. Pink. Gonna come over here. Defend. And turn. Okay. Oh man. It's quite a bit of damage. Oh, I think I had something caught in my ear. Okay. 26. Shocking soul. Actually. Oh yeah, they added the... They may have added that from 
Like that might be an actual update, which is awesome. Let's do that. Oh god, I love that. Oh, that makes it so much better. I'm so glad they did that. A bonus. Okay. They didn't have to do that, but they did, and I'm so happy that they did. Please don't. Okay, good. You didn't die. <laughs> Would have been real miffed if he died. Because honestly, that was a pretty good run. Do not skip the story. Wow, I'm impressed, hero number two. You're a true hero. No, make that a true dark hero. <laughs> Looks like you're finally seeing my full potential. So what color am I? Red? Black? Or, or something new, like gold? Oh, I didn't tell you? That show was cancelled. What? Hey, a monster destroyed the set. Well, I can't do anything about that. But I should be getting more jobs to be a hero from now on, after everything I just did. That's my Mr. Axel. <laughs> It's so great that you can be so positive for no reason whatsoever. A brutal monster appeared on set and destroyed everything during rehearsals for a hero show this morning. Surprisingly, it wasn't a main hero who defeated the monster, but a former idol who was playing a bit character. Let's watch this clip of his interview. Yeah, I was just tearing the monster apart while all the other actors were running away. I wish everyone out there could have seen me do this. Too bad the cameras weren't rolling. Well, that was the comment made by the former member of the Smarmy Army. What kind of joke was that? Why is hero number one getting all the credit? <gasps> Did he bribe the network? No. He doesn't have the money to do that. Oh, I know. This must be a part of a greater conspiracy by the network executives. Damn them. This joke has gone way too far. What's wrong, bro? Oh, uh, hey, it's nothing. I was just, you know, practicing the scene. Axel, darling. Do you have time for me right now? Oh, that must be the director. We're gonna be talking business, so can you go outside for a little bit? Okay, I'll just go play ball outside. Axel, darling, guess what? You got a part in a movie! A movie? You know that movie, Makai Wars, that's been in the works for a hundred years? That's a NIS, a, 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 yeah, that's a Nipponichi joke right there. <laughs> because I think it's, I think it's a game or whatever that just hasn't been released or it's been a while since there's been a release or something like that. Oh, sweet! That movie's being directed by Gurosawa. So I've finally been recognized by another world-class director. Oh, but uh, it's not going to be a dark hero role. Is that okay with you? Oh, that's perfectly fine. My little bro can brag about this to his friends. Oh, I'm gonna start voice training right away. I'll do anything to stand out. I -o -e -o -i -o. Should I just buy the tickets to Veldheim? <laughs> so yeah, actually getting the short end of the stick. Hey bro, I never see you on TV anymore. Is our TV broken? Oh no, it's it's not broken. I'm gonna be in a movie. TV is nothing to me now. So bro, you're not gonna be on TV anymore? Huh? What's wrong, Axial? 
My friends have been bugging me to prove how great you are by showing them a TV show that has the dark hero on it. <laughs> well, I'm talking about being the main character in a movie. I'm sure I'll be making a ton of TV appearances soon. Really? So can I tell my friends about it? Yep, you can tell them all you want. Well, it's time for me to go to work. I'll be back later. I'll be cheering for you! Chapter 2, Makai Wars. Okay, god, I freaking... I don't pee on my only suit, it was super... Freaking accident. <laughs> That's great. So, uh, we don't have any insurance. Uh, great. Uh, I love how real sometimes this, like, this guy, I guess, just like, yeah, well, you know, no insurance, so just watch out, man. Okay, do not want to accidentally talk to Shadow Lady, because that would be an unfortunate event. Except, okay, I got no crime records. I could go to the item world. Um, yeah, it's very dangerous because it has all the stuff yeah I got one Mr. Jinsey exit transfer residence but so I don't really want to do it because I'll probably get my ass handed to me but um, let's see what's available over here Axel. Ah, yes. See, I like... Uh, I like this, because now they have put in percentages on the things. Like, what is your chance of getting these things? <laughs> yeah, so I'm already at the weakest enemy. Like, I like this. Having percentages is so much better. But you can still just kind of cheese it a little bit within a range just by uh, exiting and clicking back in. Um, so, what's up, Axrail? Axrail? Guy was leading Ashes is really popular right now. Her passionate acting is critically acclaimed. Do you think you get free connect tickets? Nah, I just think we make a big profit off of it. Oh, God, I, like, I, I just love Axel's family. <laughs> Makai filming location. Desert Pallid. Hello! Hello! How are you? Alright, everyone! Let's make this a great movie, huh? Mr. Axel! This way! Here's your chair! Oh, I was just looking for somewhere to sit down. So this chair with the armrests is mine? That chair's for the main character, dude! You can't sit there! <laughs> what are you talking about, A.D.? I'm that main character, right? What's all this commotion about? Oh, Director Kurosawa! This guy is claiming that he's the main character and is trying to sit here. Oh, it's you. You're the stuntman. I'm the director, so that makes it true. I'm the stuntman? That can't be right. I, I don't do my own stunts. Look, it says that I'm the main character right over here. Yeah, it should also say that you're the stuntman on that contract, too. It's in small print, but it's there. You're right! Girl Sawa, the netherworld class director! You're so dirty and sneaky! Are you ready for your stunt? Wait, 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 wait! I'm not physically or mentally ready. <sighs> Sorry, I can't, dude! Scene one! Take one! Counterattack! In five, four, three! Dude! I 
I really feel like the Prinnies, at least in this game, they, um, they just, uh, they put like a voice modulator on them. Oh my god, these things have so much health and attack. Oh god. Okay, I think I remember what makes <laughs> Axe mode hard. Um, well, gonna have to at least try it. Um, yeah, because this mode was, uh, as I, as was originally said, it was made uh, specifically to be done after the uh, main story, so uh, it's understandable as to why it would be hard. I might actually need to... And you don't actually get a lot of characters in Axel Mode, so I might uh, need to make some more. Okay. Yeah, fuck. Well. Let's see how this goes. Poorly. This is going to go very poorly. Because I believe the clone spots also clone my characters and their enemies. So. And I'm doing 22 damage. Fantastic. Um, let's come over here. Health. Shock soul. Yeah. The most I did was 70 damage, and that is not nearly enough. So I'm actually just going to return to the title screen. Yeah, I'm just gonna quit. And, uh. Yeah, I'm just gonna skip. And go to the item world after I pick up everything again. Uh, because it's not really worth wasting my time like that. Um, there. And I should make a couple more me or a couple more characters. Um, let's have you enter, create new character. So I could make a samurai. Uh, uh, What's her, like, official name? Sword Maiden or something like that. I feel like it's getting cut off at the top, but I don't think it is. Oh, wait, there it is. Exorcist. But it's a samurai, really. Um, and you can only get these uh, by having Disgaea 1 save data, I believe, on your PSP, because it was also released on that. Um, so I'm thinking... Create new character. Thinking I'll make one sword user uh, and um, and a uh, I generally don't use wind mages right off the bat, so I'll make one of those as well. Um, Let's think. Wind, uh, Ram. Ram uses wind. You can't tell. ReZero is a show I like. Uh, let's put an int. Okay, Ram has been made. And then let's make another. Let's make an extra, because they're, they're one of the best uh, characters in the game. And... You can be, uh, Krush. I believe that's how it's spelled, Krush. At least in the books. I think it's that, I think that's how they spell it. Um, that attack. And then, um, let's equip them. So, uh, one staff, uh, nothing else. 
Uh, need to buy a sword. Expensive stuff. 63, 62, 62, 61, 69. I'd get a 70. I feel like that would be decent. Yeah, you can see where this might get annoying. Whatever. Okay. So, first of all, I'm gonna save, save. And then, I'm actually gonna. Uh, do a nice little thing. So, one cool thing is that um, you can capture uh, enemies. So what I'm going to do is prepare to capture one. So, I'm going to send Axel out. I'm going to have him defend and then end turn. These guys will come. Uh, I'm doing this purely to show you guys something cool and, well, something cool. It's just a mechanic and to unlock another type of person. Okay. Kind of wish you didn't do that, but it doesn't really matter. Um, might as well get a little bit of XP. And honestly. Uh, your attack's at 93. What's your attack? 38. Um, I feel like... Can you... Left and... Throw? Okay, good. Get Axel back in here. Throw. And then you fight inside, and you capture an enemy. Okay. And... Gonna Take her out and felt out. And turn. Okay. Wind. Okay, not enough. Okay. Luckily, you're weak to wind. Yes. And they even color coded the numbers to help with that. Hit, come on. Good. Wow, almost leveled. Defend. Go. One. Okay. And counter one, counter one. Okay. And you are zero to wind. But make sure that the sword kills. Good. So now with that, one I got an axe, and two I can come over here and her. Uh, I don't really want more and more, so I might actually. Um, I'd like to delete a character. Because... Ah, uh, fuck that. Now to create a character. Um... Where is it? Huh. Weird. So basically, what's supposed to happen is after I capture... Oh wait. Is it... Your assembly axle. Make a trainer. There it is. Fifty-one. I get yeah, fifty-three. Let's try. Welcome, to Dark Assembly. Yeah, I know how to do this. You gotta bribe them to make them like you. And in this game, well, in this game, I'm not gonna be able to force them. Uh, for a long time, I might never get to the point where I can force them. Um, level twenty, forty-five, ninety. Yeah, these guys aren't in other games, I believe. I think they're only in, like, the first couple. Um, 
Which kind of sucks, because I really like their design. Um, let's give you that. Um, yeah, take this. Yes. Um, let's begin a Yay! I can make a trainer. That's what it was. Figure it out. When and out, see if any new stuff has been made. Um, create new character. There they are. Okay. Animals lover strengthens monster units, powers up allied unit allied monsters close by, and good thanks. So useful. Uh, incompetent. Um, you're a big meaty woman. Um, <laughs> Wanda, Gabriel, Colleen, Selena, uh, Victoria, Lauren, April, Stephanie, um, I will, oh god, I'm just trying to figure out, uh, I like Lily, because I can't think of any big women. Big strong women in. Uh, let's go with attack. Yes. Okay. So now we have a bit more of a team. Uh, really equip. Uh, honestly, what's your what are your stats? Um, spears, B, axes, B, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna equip her with, um, a spear, because better range, and I have a better one on me right now. Okay. Come over here. And, uh, I'm going to save, and I'll just show you around the beginning part of, um, I'll just show you like the first stage of item world. Yeah, I know. Oh yeah, and because I quit out, I didn't actually save that text. Um, go to item world. Um, level one plus. Uh, I'll do it to the wooden staff. Uh, make my... Actually, what I'll do is I'm gonna come in here by... God, there's like no difference. There's only It's only in the speed. Um, whatever. I'll buy that hand. That way, when I level it up, I can exchange it with... Um... Yes, I can exchange it with axles. So, item worlds are still a lot bigger than they were, or than they uh, were in the fifth game, because annoyances. Um, axle. So, it's mostly just most important to uh, get to the end. You don't have to really worry about uh, killing everybody. I don't believe you get any bonuses for doing that. Okay. You do get quite a little bit of damage. Okay. And I'm going to go into settings. Put combat speed to blitz. Move. Uh. So yeah, that goes only to 10 damage, unfortunate, but uh, will allow you to get a kill, which is good. Um, you're not weak to wind, which kind of sucks. Okay. 
I can't move you around when... Okay, let's do this. Number 15. Oh god, I should get a healer as well. Because god is, is that a lot of damage. I'm only on the first level. I'd rather not use my Mr. Gen's exit on the first level. Okay. Okay. But this is how the item world looks in general, so I figured I would show you that. And uh, because this is all I'm going to be doing for like the next uh, little bit, I think I'm just going to end it here. Um, so I hope you all have a very nice day, and will join me in the next episode. Bye!